For the beginning of this, it's Charlize Theron for the cover of Vogue. Is this almost ready? So who do you want? Who, what do you want to listen to that? So that can be whatever. Like what? Just whatever. I'm going to be talking. No, don't say most whatever of because whatever I play, you it don't could like be, it. Uh, <laughs> and then while I'm finishing up, while she's starting to look amazing, you can go into who made up all the rules, and then you know that kind of thing, and then go into Bowie when I'm sticking when I'm sticking the starfish in. This whole event is about teaching you guys or exposing you guys to my process. Tease the root, spray it with and then young. Then give it personality. I wanted to really incorporate that glamour that I really love and the, the products are all about. Just a classic, beautiful girl. Beautiful girl. I'm a mess without my little China girl. Are you girls having a good time? Yes. Yeah. I'm having a great time. Good, good, good. Guy. She's kind of genius. She needs her shoes on. We need okay. to start rolling this out. I'll okay. go set that up. Are they still serving cocktails or no? See me do big, big hair here. We took it to a different era. Different era, different era. Things that I would do for Richard Avedon, and we, you know, created a, a beautiful Avedon girl with wind, and you know, it was just spectacular. Run your fingers through my hair. What I brought to Dick was the wind. wind. I was able to make the hair humongous for him and have it stand straight on end. Number one. Does she look awesome on stage? Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. I need uh, rubber bands. We've got all that shit I've out got there. Rubber bands on set. Ick. Beautiful. That's gonna be amazing. That's gonna be so cool. Can I try it? Huh? It'll be great. Yeah. Amazing, no? So cool. I was thinking the insides should be glitter, but no. Really it's beautiful like that. No, because she's gonna have hair here. Isn't that cool? They stink. <laughs> it's gonna be a dream, no? The last one for me was my favorite because it was the one that I was like totally into, and it was a mess. It really showed them how I work. I just get into it and it's a mess. And then in the last minute, it becomes spectacular. It's exactly what I drew. For me, I'm creating a dream. I think that hairdressing is an art form and is a very important art form. So therefore, I'm trying to 
make hairdressers understand that and sort of elevate them. If it isn't at the, at the end, once you're out the lid, you can remove a little bit or not. Strange is good. We want chic and beyond, eccentric, but done very simple shapes. Think young. Think young. The hurricane, it was crazy. I wanted it something wild. I wanted it to be like just raw. I wanted boys that never did makeup to do makeup. I wanted it to be something super modern and different. I wanted people to think not the norm. I wanted them to, you know, draw like this weird eye and be inspired by that and do something weird to the head. And um, I think it was inspirational for people, and, and that's what the intention was. Photograph. Pretend there's a million people out there ready to see your work. We need black lips, we need them quick. Genius. So chic. Let's go. We got like 10 minutes, guys, to get photographed and the show started. It was exciting. It was exciting to see the girls all done and looking all freaky and crazy. I liked it. I think everybody liked it. Line up. Take your time. If you want your hairdresser to see what they've done, let's line up. Just walk normal like you do as like if you were walking down the street. Thank you very much. I think we're going to give them a killer show, OK? Are you guys ready? Hairdressers, out of here so you can see your work. When you came in, the air went out And every shadow filled up with doubt I was very inspired at um, how crazy some of these hairdressers are. I love that. It was nice to pull that out of them because, you know, you don't get to do that crazy vampire-looking girl in your salon every day. So, I, I, yeah, they, they kind of impressed me. I was, wow. Heart sick and eyes filled up with blue. I don't know what you've done to me, as much as true. I want to do bad things with we wanted people to go home feeling like they're a genius. And they were. They did genius work. And so a lot of these events, sometimes people go home feeling like, eh, I wasn't very good, you know? I think everyone went home feeling, wow, I did it. I made my, I gave them a monster. I gave them something very wild and cool. And, you know, there was no right or wrong. So everyone's hair was perfect for what the inspiration was.